Good morning, my beautiful people. My name is Rachel. I'm the CEO of Debbie Beauty Spa here in northern part of Nigeria, Kano State. Today, I will be making a review on these two lotions. On these two lotions, Lemon Clay and Lemon Floss. Lemon Clay Lotion and Lemon Clay. Plus, that is what I'll be making with you. This lemon, I've been using it for a long time with this lemon clay. Before I get started, if you are yet to subscribe to my channel, subscribe, turn on your notification bell so that each time I upload my videos, you guys will see it. And please don't forget to share it to your family and friends. So like I say, I'll be making review on these two lotions. I'll be making review on these two lotions. This lemon clay contains, they say it contains vitamin C, vitamin E, glycerin, sodium, metal. Sulfides, sodium metal by sulfides. This, this lotion, let me just tell you people the fact it contains hydroquinone. This one, they say this one contains vitamin E and C. Why this one contains um, vitamin C? It contains vitamin C. And sodium metal sulfide, citric acid. So, these two lotions, let me tell you people the fat. It contains hydroquinone. The fat, the difference is that, is that maybe the hydroquinone in this one is, I mean, the hydroquinone in this one is more than that of this one that is just the two difference there is hydroquinine in both since it contains sodium metal bisulfite it has hydroquinine inside the boat has hydroquinine inside it's just that this one is more powerful than this one for all those people who are mixing or you want to resell, this one is more profitable. If you use this one to promise your lotion, you will gain it. But this one is more active than this one. This Lemon Clay Plus, <laughs> maybe I'm just saying an example. If this one contains like 2%, this one can contain like 4%. And which is even more than two. Even this one is more than 4%. It's more than 4% hydroquinine. But it's not written on it if there is hydroquinine or not. But for us to confirm, if you want to know if your lotions contains hydroquinine, I'm going to be teaching you guys now how to check it. And which is the fat? Which is the fat? If you want to know if your cream, your lotions contains hydroquinone. Most people will say, ah, I'm doing organic. Oh, it's pure organic. Pure organic will not whiten you in seven days. Pure organic will not whiten your skin in 14 days. Pure organic will not whiten your skin in one month. Anything that contains, any synthetic, any cream, I mean, that contains synthetic chemical, that is what will whiten you in seven weeks. That is what will whiten you in 14 days. That is what will whiten you in 30 days. But if you are using alpha arbutin, and glutathione honestly it will take like two months or three months before you start seeing 
the effect. And that one will give you this beautiful skin. It will. But for those of you that are using seven days, two weeks, even if there is hydroquinine too much in your lotion, you will see that you'll be experiencing some greenish um, things. You will be seeing some greenish. If you press your skin like this, it will be painful. If you press it, so, those, so there are some people that react to hydroquinone. Once it's too much on their skin, they will start reacting and you start seeing like, it's just like green veins. You start appearing on their skin. And it's so painful. If you press it, they will tell you that it's, they are feeling pains. They will tell you they are feeling pains. So if you want to use this lotion in May, Save way. You can add it with lemon. You can add it with pure almond oil. For those of you that don't want to bleach you, you just want this thing to maintain your skin. You can add it with almond oil so that it will reduce the hydroquinine in both cream. This one is more active. If you want sharp, sharp. You use this then you promise it you put all your whitening oils you want to put after putting all the whitening oils you can now put on this lemon and uh, pure almond oil after applying all those whitening serums you want to apply inside this lotion then you now applied pure almond oil or you look for lean oil organic lean oil you look for it yeah you look for it if you want to promise this too you can put your whitening serum after putting your whitening serum you had your pure almond oil guys so that you won't have all this nyama nyama all these skin reactions that normally comes out for those of you selling this is the best way because it's thick if you use it then you add your rose water you will gain it if you want sharp sharp you use this 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 more active you put your anti stretch marks anti green veins anti yamanyama that you want to put so that it won't give you any reaction. Honestly speaking, what is the hydroquinine in, inside this cream? The hydroquinine inside this cream is more than, is much. Is much, guys. So let me show you guys how you will know if your cream contains hydroquinine. Or it has any, any synthetic chemicals inside. This is how I used to know. You just apply little. Look at it. Look at it. I applied little inside. Then you look for IPO. IPO. You turn it inside just little hypo then you will notice this greenish guys i don't know i can show you i please you can see it like this you can see it is greenish greenish you see when chemical and chemical jump together you will see it you see guys <laughs> guys you see once chemical and chemical jump together, you will see it. This, this contains synthetic. It has synthetic inside, synthetic chemicals inside. So you have to be careful of the serum you applied because we don't know how many percent of hydroquinine that is inside this lemon clay. Then once you now start putting on different types of serum, guys, you start having problem on your skin. 
you start having problems on your skin. Please guys, let's be careful of what we apply it on our skin. This one now, we don't know how many percent of hydroquinone. Look at how, how the, the cream turns to be. Look at it. For you to know that it has hydroquinone inside. Compared to this, if you test this, this uh, kit um, lotion, it's very pure. It won't change color. If you have it, just look for Johnson Baby Lotion and this Lemon Clay. Test the Johnson Baby Lotion and test this. You will see the words I'm saying. If you think I'm lying, you will see it. So let's be careful. If you put all your whitening serum, make sure you put your lime oil. Make sure you put your almond oil to reduce the power. So that you won't have reaction on your skin. It won't give you green veins. Especially for those teeny uh, ladies that doesn't have body. If you are using all these synthetic creams, before you know it, you start stretch marks, we start pumping. I mean, green veins, we start pumping out of your skin. So to calm all this down, after applying and uh, putting all this whitening serum, make sure you put your almond oil and lean oil. So that it will balance it for you. So guys, I'll be seeing you guys in my next video. Please, don't forget, if you are watching me right now, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Turn on your notification bell so that each time I upload my videos, you guys will see it. Thank you and God bless you all.